Last year when I was getting all that pushback online, everybody was calling me a pansy. I made sure to plant a lot of pansies up here. <laughs> and they grew really well. I want to talk about a bridge between the institutional church and the LGBT Catholic community. Now, some Catholics object to this, which is putting it mildly. One U.S. bishop has criticized you very strongly, saying you're part of an LGBT lobby within the church. It's amazing the number of people who want to argue with Jesus on Twitter, <laughs> even if you quote them. We believe homosexual activity is immoral. I don't know what the cross is if you're Father Martin and the whole gay thing. Where's the suffering? Where's the sacrifice? One time I was at mass and I started having a panic attack. It just felt so unaccepting. People want to be angry that someone is gay. It doesn't make any sense. Why are issues of sexuality such a flashpoint for contention? In terms of controversial topics, this would probably be the most controversial. My brothers and sisters, never underestimate the pain that LGBT people have experienced at the hands of our own church. This is all part of the great gaying of the church. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are you. The Catholic Church really should have done so much more. This is civil war, Catholic, gay, civil war for the soul of the church. I always want to be close to Jesus. That's why I'm doing all this. Here comes the sun. Where's our rainbow? <laughs> Coming soon to Video On Demand.